welcome back to the channel. My name is Katie. If you saw the title of today's video, guys, we have more from Elon Musk in a possible listing for Tesla and SpaceX. We know those are his two companies and rumors have been flying that he will be listing Shiva Inu soon. Now, if you guys have been following my channel, you know the rumors have it that both Elon Musk and Amazon, we've actually been hearing from Jeff Bezos, even though Jeff isn't at Amazon anymore, we're hearing both from Jeff and from Amazon that there is going to be a listing soon there too. And we know that they have been building out their cryptocurrency. So if you guys want, go check out all of my Elon Musk and all of my Amazon videos. It'll get you a little more up to speed and up to date. But we know Elon is like the godfather of crypto, or in my opinion, like the godfather of the Inu and the Doge coins. And he's speaking up and he has a lot to say. And in my opinion, this just shows we're getting a listing very, very soon. So what am I talking about and what am I referring to? Let's jump on my computer and find out, but before we do, let me introduce myself to those that are new. Hi, how are you? My name is Katie and on this channel, I cover everything in the crypto sphere, including altcoins, meme coins, uh, the cryptocurrency in general, everything you can think of, but the one that I'm really especially involved with is Shiba Inu. This coin is hot. It's got all the mimetic power of all the great meme tokens, and it's why it's the number one meme token. And not to mention just that, it also has so much utility, has way more utility than all the other meme coins. And I think because of this, we have such a big, bright future for Shiba. I'm so bullish on the price, and I think we can, if not in 2022, at least 2023, be a top 10 contender with all the things we have coming down the pipeline. So this is what I do, and this is what I cover. And the last thing I want to tell you, I'm giving away a $100 gift card. And guys, it's really simple. To be entered and eligible to win my money, this is all you have to do. Like the video, subscribe, hit notifications, comment, share the content, watch a video from start to finish. Boom, you're entered, you're eligible. That's all you have to do. And guys, make sure and do it for every single video you see because the more likes, the more shares, the more comments, the more times you watch from start to finish, the more chances you have of winning my money because the more times you are entered to win. And guys, my channel is still so small teeny tiny baby channel over here, but that's good news for you because it means not many people are doing this, so you have a good shot of winning. So make sure and take these steps. It's free and it takes seconds. Guys, I'll announce winners on Sunday, so make sure and watch all of Sunday's videos to see if you've won. Good luck, everyone. So what am I referring to? Well, we know Elon Musk Every time he tweets about one of the Inu coins, it skyrockets. The one that he seems to be the most bullish on, though, is Doge. He recently started accepting Doge as payment for certain merchandise and then other things on his website. However, he has been speaking up and he has been breadcrumbing, which makes a lot of us believe certain things we're seeing is he is actually ready to use and take on Shiva Inu. So for instance, he was on Lex Friedman's podcast recently and Lex Friedman had asked, so is Doge going to be the official coin of Mars? To which he said, no. And he explained the science. Now, take all of this with a very scientific grain of salt because obviously I'm the world's best scientist you've ever seen, right? So I will try to explain this the, the way that I remember him saying it. So please though, don't, don't quote me completely. The problem is to use Doge, there are gonna be issues with the way light travels. I don't know if that's exactly light speed, but it has to do with the way light is going to travel. And he said it would be too slow and it could take 20 to 30 minutes to do one transaction. So Dogecoin would not work on the moon, but you know what would that could build the utility to do it because it has the utility that could build the platform, Shiba. And he has said before, if he's gonna work with coins, he likes meme coins because all the other coins, he says it just makes the richer rich which I love because that means he's for the little guys like us. So that's where we're at right now. And there have been rumors that he is about to list Shiba Inu left, right, and center, and he's spoken up again. So let's see what Elon has to say now about Shiba, Doge, and the crypto industry. Okay, guys, this is from DMarge, and it says, Elon Musk drops big cryptic crypto prediction. Elon Musk has made a claim that has some crypto holders ecstatic and others groaning and rolling their eyes. Responding to a tweet by Billy Marcus, co-founder of Dogecoin, who is no longer on the project, who asked why Dogecoin can't be both a joke but also useful. Musk earlier today wrote, the most entertaining outcome is most likely. Now let's read that again. It says, responding to a tweet by Billy Marcus, co-founder of Doge, who is no longer in the project who asked why Dogecoin can't be both 
Um, a joke, but also useful, Musk earlier wrote, the most entertaining outcome is the most likely. Interesting. This comes days after Tesla announced it would begin accepting Doge as payment for some of its merchandise in its shop online. Also, according to you today, recently, several major and small businesses have begun to accept payments in the largest meme cryptocurrency, Dogecoin, including the largest U.S. chain of cinemas, AMC, gaming behemoth Nexon, GameStop, and Mark Cuban-owned Dallas Mavericks. And you can see the tweet here from Shibatoshi. I don't understand why people still have meltdowns about Dogecoin's original joke. Elon says the most entertaining outcome is the most likely. So then it says, since Elon Musk made his comment 15 hours ago from time of writing this article, Dogecoin's price has fallen. So maybe he's lost his touch or maybe it's only his individual tweets that drive speculative investors crazy. I think it's probably more the individual tweets. That's just my opinion. And it says this isn't the first time Musk has made this entertaining remark or thrown his support behind Dogecoin. In August last year, Musk said Dogecoin is the best cryptocurrency as a medium of exchange, a remarkable claim given the massive price swings it's known for. So why does he say such things? It could just be that he finds playing with the market fun. But still, as Business Insider reports, skeptics struggle to see what figures like Musk and Cuban see in Dogecoin because it's super volatile and more complicated to use for purchases than mainstream payment methods. Neither of these men have provided a solid reason as to why Dogecoin is the best coin to be used as a medium of exchange on the market. Musk has previously talked about the potential to develop it into something more ready to be used as a currency. Last year hinting he is in talks with Dogecoin developers to see if Tesla could potentially start accepting Dogecoin as payment and recently confirming the news, at least in terms of online store merchandise. However, more than anything, it seems Musk's faith in Dogecoin being able to be used to buy and sell goods and services is based on his perception that Dogecoin is the coin with the most love for it and arguably with the largest community feel. Or more accurately, just in his view, the most entertaining outcome because it would be the most absurd or the biggest blank year. I think that's spot on and I agree with that. We'll get into that in a minute. That said, the popularity could, and perhaps to a degree already, give Dogecoin developers the power and resources they need to develop it. So maybe we shouldn't be so quick to sneer. There could be a skerrick of truth in there somewhere. Who knows? When everyone is diving, or sorry, driving around in Lambos and spelling when, when, maybe we'll be eating our words. Musk has also previously said Dogecoin is significantly quicker at processing transactions and uses less energy than Bitcoin. That's not hard enough given how slow Bitcoin is. It's also not a huge claim to fame as there are a bunch of other coins which were made specifically to fill this niche rather than being made as a parody of Bitcoin. So does being a joke originally mean Dogecoin can't be engineered into something useful? Only time will tell. What's for sure, though, is that it does appear to have barking mad fan base who would be keen to see it happen. But then, so do most of the new breed of Ethereum enders like Cardano, Solana, Nano, and Terra. And then somebody responds to Elon says the most entertaining outcome is the most likely. They say the problem with that way of thinking is that it omits the tens of thousands of hours of human ingenuity that has flown into optimizing and improving Bitcoin since the joke started. That makes a difference that cannot be replaced with just being the most entertaining outcome. And I understand what that person is saying, but I'm gonna disagree a little bit, and I'll explain why in a second. Not to mention, some people believe Bitcoin has been engineered to be far better than Dogecoin could ever catch up to, despite its slow transaction times. As one Twitter user recently wrote, the problem with that way of thinking is that it omits the tens of thousands of hours of human ingenuity that has flown into optimizing and improving Bitcoin since the joke started. That makes a difference that cannot be replaced with just being the most entertaining outcome. Who will end up top dog is anybody's guess. 
It certainly isn't mean though, as my thousand crypto experiment still has me licking my wounds. Okay, let's talk about this. I've been saying this for a while. One of the reasons on this channel I'm so bullish on meme coins and I'm telling you guys not to just poo-poo them like everybody else or put them down or call them all scams is because of the entertainment value. Elon understands what I've been saying, not that Elon and I talk, oh, Elon watches this channel. So many YouTubers, guys, and it's funny because a lot of times it's the smaller guys, they think that everybody watches their stuff and they assume you do, and if you don't, they're super offended. And it's always funny to me because I'm like, I assume nobody watches my stuff, but I'm always grateful that they do, right? But yeah, no, Elon's not gonna be watching my channel. It's not like he's watching me going, she's brilliant, she knows, now I'm gonna pick up on her ideas. Yeah, Elon really needs me. What I'm saying, though, is that he's on the same wavelength I am in terms of how we're looking at this. People have underestimated the power of just plain entertainment value and the power of the little guy like us to want to laugh and say F you to the elites. This is why I love my coin, Doge Bonk. Doge, Doge Bonk recently trolled Elon in the funniest way. I'll have to, I'll do a video at some point explaining, but it's the funniest thing you've ever seen. But one of my second to third biggest holdings right now is Doge Bonk, and that coin has taken off and done really well and continues to really grow. And it's because it's one big F you to the establishment in a way that's really fun and really funny. Think about this, guys. Think about how much money is in the entertainment industry. A lot of people will go spend $100, $200, $300 to see one night of comedy, and then it's it. It's done. You were entertained for an hour. So what's the difference between that and a meme coin that's got funny memes that are constantly making you laugh, that you can be a part of, and then you get to make money? You don't get to leave the comedy show and make money off of it, guys. Do you know what I'm saying? As a spectator of it, it's one and done. But these meme coins are, if they are really surrounding memes, it's the gift that keeps on giving. There is so much entertainment value, and that's why I think people have really missed the boat and missed the mark with why these coins are going to be valuable. Now, I understand people being upset because it's like, how can they come in here and do so well and the coins who really have all this utility and can really do all these real world stuff get overlooked? Well, that's just the beauty of marketing, my friend. Because the meme coin, even though people want to be mad at it, it's all in how you market yourself and that's all of life. Guys, I grew up as an entertainer, right? And let's talk, okay, for instance, we know Britney Spears, I know I'm getting kind of off topic, but Britney has been in the news lately a lot, right? She was so popular back in the day that people couldn't wait to tear her down and put her in a mental institution. It's sad, but it's true. I laugh because it's so frustrating, but it's what we did. This is how the mindset was back in the aughts. And so many people, like they tried to pit Britney Spears and Christina Aguilera, and they go, why is Britney? And I'm, I'm not saying one is above the other. I like them both. I'm an entertainer. I actually went the Disney route, so I understand them to a degree. And it's like, well, Christina's the better singer, so why isn't she more popular? And people would do that. Well, it's, it's got to be where the talent is. It's more talent. And Britney is extremely talented. I'm not saying she's not, but people would see her and they'd think she's more attractive appeal than talent, which it's not. It's just a different form of talent. And she has the vocal chops. It's just that she had a team that wouldn't allow her to really express and use it in the same way. That she was being used up one side, down another, and there was nobody to protect her. Anyways, not to get too much into Britney, but my whole point is you would hear these arguments about, well, Britney's just all the blank appeal and people be mad about it. At the end of the day, guys, it's how she marketed herself and her talent, period. It's how she marketed herself. It's all marketing. Why do some products that aren't as good end up beating out other products that are better? Marketing. So I would say, I think we might actually see more coins with utility go the meme route because that's gonna end up building their coin quicker and becoming more popular. I'm wondering if we're gonna end up seeing that turn. And we're going to end up seeing people understand how important it is not just to have the coin, but to market it well. It doesn't just have to be a serious thing. And I think we're all tired of the super serious because the super serious seems to be the psychopaths at the top super seriously telling all of us we need to be slaves to them. And it's done. So why not a big F you to them? We get to laugh and troll them and make money. I think Elon's got it. And I think from what he's saying as well about Dogecoin, guys, and he said the utility isn't there that we need for Mars, I think this is bullish for Shiba. And I think if he likes Doge, we're getting a Shiba listing soon. And that's where I'm tying this all together. I think Shiba's coming down the pipeline when it comes to Tesla. I think we just have to wait and be patient. We know he loves the meme coins and we know he has said he likes Doge, but it's lacking. What's the next best thing? Our Shiba. 
Okay guys, if you like this video and want to support my channel, you can do both. It's free, it takes seconds, and you can win my money. You can do all of it. This is all you have to do. Like the video, subscribe, hit notifications, comment, share the content, watch a video from start to finish, boom. You're entered, you're eligible, that's all you have to do. Guys, make sure and do it for every video you see. The more likes, more shares, more comments, more times you watch from start to finish, the more chances you have of winning my money because the more times you're entered to win. You guys know my channel is small, teeny tiny baby channel over here, but what does that mean for you? It means you have a really good shot of winning my money because not many people are doing this. So take those steps. As traders, we hate to leave money on the table, so make sure and take the steps to get your money and claim it. Guys, I'll announce a winner on Sunday. Make sure and watch all of Sunday's videos to see if you've won. Good luck, everyone. Okay, guys, that's it for me here. Take care, lots of love, lots of blessings. Till the next video, I'm giving everybody hugs, kisses, stay safe, and I will see you soon. Bye, guys.